What is going on guys, it's from KC Technology here, in this video I'm going to be talking about the second generation Ryzen processors and APUs that are going to be coming out throughout 2018. If you haven't subscribed to my channel, please subscribe to my channel now. Like for more videos, comment down below on what you think about this video, but try not to put any bad comments. With that being said, let's get started. Now, starting off this video is the Ryzen desktop APUs will be coming out in Q1 of 2018 and the second generation Ryzen desktop grade CPUs will be coming out in Q2 of 2018 while the second generation Ryzen Threadripper and Ryzen Pro processors will be coming out in the second half of 2018. On the mobile side of things, the Ryzen 3 mobile APU will be coming out in Q1 of 2018, while the Ryzen Pro mobile APU will be coming out in the Q2 of 2018. Now, there is rumor that AMD will be, will be releasing a uh, Ryzen 7 uh, mobile, not mobile, but um, desktop uh, CPU, but they haven't released any information on that processor now on February 12th uh, they will AMD will be releasing new APUs which will be the Ryzen 3 2200G and the Ryzen 5 2400G the 2200G will be coming out at $99 while the 2400G will be starting out at 169 now I really think that due to uh, Bitcoin mining that these processes will go up or they will just probably disappear off the uh, uh, market for a while um, due to the fact that if you get discrete graphics plus the Radeon Vega graphics that are built into these APUs, uh, they will start using these APUs for Bitcoin mining as well as the de dedicated graphics that are built in, well not built into the processor, but the uh, dedicated graphics that you could buy off the shelves like a Radeon RX 580 or a Titan X or something like that. Now the 2200G will start off with a 3.5 GHz base clock and a 3.7 GHz turbo boost clock. The 2400G will start off with a 3.6 GHz base clock, a 3.9 GHz max boost clock. The 2200G will feature 4 cores, 4 threads, and 8 compute units, while the 2400G will uh, feature 4 cores, 8 threads, and 11 compute units. Ryzen is changing the rules with high performance PCs. Now, I already said this already, Ryzen desktop APUs will be coming out on February 12th. Ryzen second generation uh, CPUs will be coming out on April 2018. The mobile APU, the well, the Ryzen 3 mobile APU will be coming out January 9th, which is today. The Ryzen Pro mobile APUs will be coming out in Q2 of 2018. AMD ha was able to keep all of these CPUs and APUs on the same AM4 platform, which include the first generation CPU, the second generation, the second generation uh, CPU. Um, the desktop APUs with Radeon Vega graphics and the 7th generation AMD APUs. Now AMD is paving a new x86 or roadmap um, leadership. Now this did start off with the Zen architecture on 20, well in 2017 with a 14 nanometer process. But now with the Zen Plus architecture you'll, you will be receiving a 12 nanometer process and this the these are the first processors processors to do this while the Zen 2 architecture will be featuring a 7 nanometer process and the Zen 3 will feature a 7 nanometer plus process which will be coming out in 2020 now the new chipset that AMD has been has released will be the X470 now this motherboard or this chipset will be 
optimized for second generation CPUs. It will also feature a low power consumption and will be launching on 2018 of on April. Well, in April. Now, due to the fact that these CPUs and APUs will be on the AM4 platform, all of the seventh generation uh, AMD APUs will be compatible with the X470 chipset. The First generation Ryzen processors will be compatible with the X470 chipset as well as any second generation CPU and uh, desktop grade APU with Radeon Vega uh, graphics will also be compatible with the X470 as well as any older gen M4 chipset which will include the A320, B350 and the X370. That'll be it for today, guys. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Please be sure to leave a like, comment down below, and subscribe to my channel. All the links to my social media is in the description box down below. With that being said, I'm MKC Technology. I'm out. Peace. Brother,